Hi YouTube. Uh, today I am 13 weeks and one day, and um, I haven't had that, that many symptoms this week. I'm still not nauseous. I'm still uh, feeling pretty normal, except for the whole hunger thing. Ow. Um, Madeline. Um, but I two times this week I kind of felt. At least I think I felt the baby move. Um, I felt little, very light taps, I guess you can say. Kind of like gas, like the gas, but very, very, very light. Like it didn't, it wasn't gas. I can tell it wasn't gas, but it was like really light. It felt like it was, the, it was like tapping uh, from like close to my belly button all the way down. So I don't know, but it was like inside. So, um... That could have been or could have not been, I'm not sure, but it was different and I only felt it once. And then a couple of days later I felt like a like something move like a whoosh kind of feeling inside. So that could have also been the baby, but it could have not. Um sometimes when I lay down I can feel like like a hard ball. Uh, in my lower stomach area, um, so that could be the baby also, but I could be wrong, you know, this is my first child and stuff like that, so if you guys have any tips or anything like that, then, you know, let me know, or if you have any information, you know, let me know. Um, also, I'm, again, I'm hungry all the time, all the time, like it doesn't, hey, what are you doing? Like it doesn't, um... I'm always hungry, and when I go to eat, I can eat, and then I'll get full, and then 10 minutes later, I'm hungry again. So, yeah, that's, I don't know if that's going to change anytime soon. Um, I didn't want her, she's up here on the bed with me, because if she's in her kennel, and she knows I'm in the room, she's going to start crying. Um, and other than that, just feeling tired. So, that's basically it for this week, so it was kind of exciting, but kind of boring, I guess, at the same time. Those couple times that I thought I felt the baby move was kind of, you know, exciting. Madeline! Madeline! Come here! Um, also, I've been getting several questions. One of the questions that I get, you know, quite frequently is, um, how old am I? And I'm actually 27 years old. So, stop it! Jeez, dog, you're gonna go back in your kennel! She's like, I'm sorry. I don't see you. But, yeah. So, yeah, I'm 27 years old. Um, I know I look a lot younger than I actually am. I get that a lot. And a lot of places that I go, um, I still get ID'd. So, um, hey. Uh, what else was I going to say? I know I got several other questions that I wanted to answer. I can't remember. I should have written them down. That was one of the main ones that I that I get have been getting a lot is how old am I? Um, oh, and another one is is if Bob and I are married. We're not married. Uh, we do plan on getting married, but right now, hey, uh, we're gonna wait till after the baby's born, and then we'll you know go and do it. Um, what else? I know there was more. Look at this. Look at this dog. I don't know if you can see her. Let me see if you can see her. She's crazy. She loves blankets and pillows. So, yeah. Anyway. <laughs> um, oh, and I got on my Facebook fan page, the link will be down below if you want to go check it out. I've been getting questions on if I'm going to get like a P.O. box or anything like that. Um, I think I am, but... I might wait till a little bit later. I, I guess I'll let you guys know. Um, and I'll probably post it on my YouTube page or maybe on each video or something like that. Uh, and yes, if you... Because I know I've been getting a lot of like other um, companies, like other bow makers and all this other stuff, asking if they can send me stuff. And yet, like, I wouldn't mind. You know, that, that'd be pretty awesome. And of course, I would, you know, advertise your, your business um, and stuff like that. So... And I do plan on, like, a lot of people are saying, oh, you're so lucky because you make your own bows and stuff like that. But I actually do plan on buying from other people also. Um, 
so, because there's a lot of other styles out there that I like that I know once the baby gets here, I'm not going to really have that much time to make. Um, I hope I do. But, of course, I want to have, like, different styles and just other people's bows and stuff like that, too, so. And I like to support the the small businesses and stuff like that, so. Yeah. So, I guess that's basically it for week 13. Um, I guess right now we'll go do the the belly shot and the the measurement and my weight. So, I'll see you right now. Okay. The pants I'm wearing are actually my scrubs, so. Don't mind the... And I got them a size big because, of course, they're going to grow. Um, so this is my 13-week belly. This is from the front. This is from the side. Oh, and actually, this week, I actually got noticed for the first time. Not really, like, not to my face, but there were some kids that were kind of, like, goofing around. They kept dropping stuff, and they weren't able to reach it from where I was, so I would go and pick it up and give it to them, and this lady that was next to them, I don't know if it was her mom or not, but she got after them and said, uh, she's like, I think she's pregnant. Don't be making her pick stuff up. So it was pretty funny. So. First time somebody in public has actually noticed. So, yeah. This is my belly, belly with the shirt on, and here's with the shirt up, the front, the side, and my belly button is actually starting to pop out. You can see that, and I'm starting to get a lot more hair in my stomach. On the other side. And the Taking so long. Okay, so it's probably about the same, or maybe not. I'm not sure. I don't remember what it was last week. It's 31 and about three fourths. You can see that. Okay, now let's go do my weight. Okay, this is my weight for week 13. Holy cow! 117.3. I did eat, like, I think about an hour ago. So maybe they might have added a couple pounds. That's crazy. 117.3. So, there you go. See you guys next week.